The following is only intended for mature audiences. This program contains strong language, controversial opinions about controversial people, outrageous guests, and true villainy. If you cannot handle these things, then respectfully, you are a bitch. And this probably isn't the show for you. Your discretion is advised. Starting following niggas. Yeah, I'm always following anyone like like celebrities. This nigga's blowing up, and now he's just all nah, of a sudden following that's, niggas. That's definitely not what it is, bro. People be on following me for no reason. Shit. Man, Matt Hollywood, Plus, bro. A lot of, half the celebrities I be following don't follow up my feed, so they about to just go to my feed. I I know I understand like you're a celebrity, oh, no. now, so you celebrity of what? So you can't like follow certain celebrities if you don't know them personally. You know? But celebrities of celebrity of what, bro? Yes, bro. I'm not no celebrity. We get it. We Y'all get it. are both bigger than me. What are you talking about? You bro, left us in the dirt. That's so cat, bro. You know what's crazy? We still in the hood. Remember we said like nice. two days ago that you saw uh, Nia saw someone when you were working out at the gym. Well, that's not every talk, time. Let's not talk about every that. single no, actually, time. Let's let's talk about that. Let's every talk single about time. That. I actually want to talk about. It's that. not even. We're about not going to talk about that. You know what's crazy? I wrote some like topics down for this episode, and oh, there's God. only one, and it's actually that. Oh, so right. we're gonna Crazy. talk about it. Nah, cause like, and it's funny because like, every single time we go to work out, he sees at least one person that he knows. Every time, if we, we see it's someone, a thing now. we see people I know, but that's rare. You at least once every single time. Well, that's because yeah. the old Haitians work out. After it's not work. always old Haitians, bro. You know, old that. Haitians. The it's, not, it's, it's not. not it's not. It's my uncle. That's good. it's I, not old it's Haitians, not bro. bro. That happens like maybe half the time, but the other half is people that are age and stuff. You know, bro, that's true. Half, half the time it's either. People that my family know, or that people that like know my brother. Again, my family. Like, nice, so he's, he's, he's popular, bro. Bro, it's not me. It's I fine. Just, Look, you're popular, bro. It's, it's fine. I'm not. You don't even you don't even need a soul series because you don't need it. Yeah, that's, exactly. that's why you're so you're popular. Just yeah, exactly. Damn, I started filming it too. Now I'm lying. I'm capping. <laughs> my fault. You got a storyboard though. I printed it out and everything. A word? Yeah, I didn't draw any yet. <laughs> <laughs> this thing got a blank story. Yeah, bro. But you got the storyboard, though. Yeah, I'd be That's looking at it for inspiration. You feel me? And I don't be inspired. No more. Word, word, word. You good, you good. Welcome back to the Super Villain Show. I'm your host, Injustice, your local Super Villain. We got two. Quan's not here today. Uh, Fuck him. But I, repl- I replaced him with another light skinned Negro. To my right. No, to your left, you mean. No, to my right. To your left. No, you and Quan nah, are the same. I'm the darkest. To your. To your right, bro. I'm dark as fuck. I got two very special guests on the pod. Long time coming, even though this is only the 13th episode. You're to my right, my light skin brethren, the big boss guy, Shamir. You're not going to dab him up. That's wild. Brother, I'm dark as hell. I don't know what you're talking about light skin right, for. Camp, this, is, this is like a video podcast so they can see you. Yeah, they can see how dark I am. And to my left, my other brethren, young RDA, or RDA good. AVA. Young good, you feel me? Chilling. Dagger Dick Mel. I don't know about all that. But, all know, three members here. of Juicebox TV in the building, bro. It's a fact, though. It's good, y'all. Bro, it's, it's been a millennia on, since this happened. Has millennia? this ever happened? Uh, of, of us what? Like, of being together? Being, y'all yeah. came on my it's old podcast. We, we, hung, we literally hung out like last week, bro. Facts, facts, facts. facts. Oh, dude, damn. <laughs> y'all came on my old podcast. <laughs> I just be missing so. y'all. I'm sorry. I miss facts, you too, man. Facts. I miss you too, bro. You're not hiding the jacket? The jacket is tough. Jacket is fire. Stop playing with me. Fire jacket. The leather... With the pop smoke shit, bro. Nah. <laughs> oh. why, why, why the pop smoke impressions? Shawty said she a foreigner. You know, it's crazy. I don't even know when it, he started doing that. He yeah, just randomly started doing that. I, I don't know, man. I think I might have seen it as a meme or something. It just spoke to me. You feel me? Sometimes things speak to you. No, the pop smoke voice really be getting the girls, though. Like, if you, if you got a deep voice. That's why he got so many if, girls going If you got a pop him. smoke voice, I'm not going to lie, you're winning in life. Because the girls love that. They love that raspy, deep voice. So... Oh. That was that. I don't think that was the voice he was talking nah, about, bro. But you know, you, you tried. <laughs> That's what matters. Into the mic. <laughs> you tried, Shit, man. No, you this tried. is a grunt. Oh, that was just a different type of grunt. Nah, that was bro. just nasty. Yeah, bro. Like it's not like you doing something. It's not like, it's not like you going crazy, bro. <laughs> going crazy. I don't know about that, man. Shit, man. What's up? How y'all living, man? Bro, I've been I. Right, you feel me? 
I'm I've been chilling. Stop being humble. You live in the dream, bro. You blew up. How am I how'd I blow up, Shimmy? Blew up. How'd I blow up? Bro, like you got eight, nine TikToks with like a hundred thousand billion views, bro. Talk your shit. Nah. You, you monetizing everything. You the next Bryce Hall, bro. Yeah, bro. Brent YouTube <laughs> YouTube sent you a check, bro. If nah. YouTube sent you a check, that's crazy. You did not send me one. no yeah. you did not send me no check. I have a couple reels that that done all right, but Talk your shit. It's not like Look at I'm going crazy. Humble. Not that we're crazy. You humble, Mel. Yeah. Nah, man. Plus, it's better to be humble. Anyway, imagine I came out here and I was like, "Yo, bro, like I'm better. I'm like the best person in New York. That would be so wild. I'm the like... fucking king of the eight four five. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like, like imagine. Nah, that would be crazy. Bro. Like, nah, we just walk in like. You mean I have to wait in line? Do you know who I am? They I'm already ABA. I got two reels that hit fine K, nigga. Two. <laughs> two. <laughs> like that's crazy, I get bro. This for free. Like imagine bro, like, bro, like bro, that. Get Y'all should pay me. Facts. Nah, it's, nah, it's like really funny because there's like there's some girls I've been trying to interview. Like hit up for In, interviews. Interview. No, <laughs> like legit like public interviews Inter- and inter- like we do interview. we do like class though. Okay, there's okay. There's girls that hit up and they're like, they have more followers than me and stuff like that. But they'd be like, "Am I getting paid?" And the second That's they crazy. say that. I leave them alone because I'm yeah. like, what the heck? Like, what? No, bro. Bro, like, just slide them $10. Getting paid is crazy. How many subs they have? No, they don't have subs. They just have like- I mean, how many followers? Followers. They're always around like 10, 12K, 17K. Bro. You want to get paid for that? 10, That's what I'm trying to say, bro. That's like, nuts. why are you, why are you trying to get paid? That's like, nuts, why are you bro. trying to get paid, bro? Like, wait, like- Four for four. Huh? My bad. Biggie bag. You know what I've learned doing this content <laughs> Biggie bag could work. You know what I've learned doing this content shit, bro? A lot of these niggas got some fake followers, bro. No, no. Like, mad body. Whether it's bots or whether it's bot, mad body. I did in my old podcast. I did an interview, and this nigga had like fifty k, bro. Them shits had to be, them shits had to be fake followers because one, his music was ass, and two, like if you have fifty k followers, I feel like you shouldn't like you should have more than like five comments per post. You feel me? Nah, you definitely should. Like you definitely should. Like when I see when I look at a. Followers now and stuff like that. I'm like, with girls, I'm like nine times out of ten, your problems are your followers are probably legit. With guys, I'm like, let me see. True, true, true. true yeah, true, true, with girls true, true, nine times. No, no, but, but like, true. Think about it though. Like, what kind of person are you to be actually be like commenting on Instagram posts? What? What you mean? <laughs> you don't comment. You don't support your friend. I, they comment? I, I don't comment on posts like that for real. I don't either. But like, I comment. Like, on, I, that's that's dick right now. I comment. That's dick right now. Yeah, you on a nigga dick? Yo, you told him happy birthday. You on a nigga dick? You on a dick, bro? That's crazy. <laughs> like, damn, bro. So you don't comment. Don't make me go on your Instagram right now because I know I'm a I'm a pub of a couple of young ladies. It's cat because sure like he definitely commented. There's definitely uh one post I had and you beef with someone in my in my comment section. Facts. Yeah, but niggas talking shit. That's different. Shmir got ops. I mean, not that's a fact that's though. He, he did come at you first. Yeah, he did come at you first. He did. He did. My shiesty mask is coming in. You ordered a shiesty mask? Yeah, bro. What color? I got the variety pack. The variety pack. It's a variety pack of shiesties. I'm not even gonna lie. When I see like a camo shiesty, I'm like, why are these kind of fire? And why do I want one? Like, you ever seen like a blue camo shiesty? Bro, Amazon, eBay. I'm trying to say, they don't like $10. Amazon like, got everything though. Bro, I'm trying hit, to say, they don't like no, $10. So might as well get it, right? No, time out, time out, time out. Not $10. Here's the link in my bio. No, bro, you off. don't have. No, that's that's cap. Yeah. That's cap. That's cap. No. <laughs> this but, nigga's lying. Yeah, that's cap. But like, that's what you were saying though. But the followers, not even just the followers in general. A lot of people in the community of like social media, they be fake. Like, it's, it's actually really gross, bro. Like, I, I look. You don't even want to be wearing this, bro. Look, look at this guy. Like, I'm not. He, I think it's talking like influencer. Exactly. I'm not. I didn't blow up. I didn't exactly, blow up. Bro. I didn't blow up. But I'm just saying, like, I'm not blowing up at all. I don't think I'm blowing up at all. Bro, but I'm saying a lot of people be fake. No, he be networking and he's seeing the fakeness. That's what it is. Like, yeah, nah, yeah, the fakeness yeah. is actually crazy. Oh, you know, no, that's definitely part of nah, it. Nah, because like I'm not going to say what it is. Honestly, they probably ain't going to watch this. I don't fuck it. But damn, I what went, you mean? Huh? That's the most viewed podcast in the universe. Nah, yeah, so, but nah, bro, I'm with the messiness, bro. Say his name. What's his name? <laughs> what's his IG? I, oh. I can't say it. I'm going to put the IG right there. Yeah, what's his social security? I can't say it, but basically. Oh, yeah, we need that. I'm not going to say it. So basically, this guy uh, hit me up my DM. He was like, yo, I saw you wearing uh, our stuff. I want, um, you're cool. I fuck with your content. And he followed me. I'm like, I right, were cool like that. He followed me. And then I was like, you know what? He did He was like having a thing in the mall, like a stand. I'm like, I know I'll pull up, see what's up, say hi. Cause like he supported me. I'm like, let me just see hi, see what's up with him. I was about like, maybe I can interview him too. I interviewed him and he was a cool guy or whatever. Oh, I know the, his about. friend, his friend was talking to me and he was like, I'm not going to lie, bro. Every single post you have in this, in this little, little item you have, I'm not going to say what it is, but the, every single thing you have. Where this item, I want you to tag the page. And I'm like, why? In my mind, I'm like, why do I have to do that? 
That's crazy. Like why? I'm like, why, I interviewed him, and I'm like, I don't even want to post your shit now because like, why yeah, you ask me to do that? That is if, thirsty. I would have like, I would have done it anyway on the post that y'all are involved in. Mm-hmm. That's that's how I see it. Cause like, yeah. I would yeah, the post you're involved in, I'll I'll do it, whatever. But the fact that you said doing every single post, I'm like, what? Is, like, bro, who are you, son? Like, what do you? What do you? What do I owe you to do that? You know what's crazy? I know exactly who you're talking about because he DM'd me too. No, he didn't. Yeah, and I actually like I I wear his clothes all the time. You're talking about um after love, right? <laughs> no, I wasn't <laughs> talking about <laughs> that's that's you so that's you so right after love. Yeah, I wasn't talking about, about that about point's far, right? Wait, 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 I was sitting here like, damn, I didn't get no DM. <laughs> this nigga feeling left out for real. Nah, that's and crazy. then you said after love, and I'm like, yep, makes sense. <laughs> Oh, nah, shit, nah, it's, I'm it's, kidding. Shout, shout out to Twan, bro. Nah, nah. Shout, Twan actually like no. Nah. That's another fuck. I, that's probably fuck him. one of the few people. No, that fuck I him. Heavy. What? Yeah, fuck him. What's wrong with Twan? He don't invite me nowhere. I'm not gonna lie. Rockin' kind of trash, but no. Rockin' is out Twan. No, Rockin' is garbage. No, he's a part of the trash of <laughs> Rockin'. <laughs> like you, you got. I'm telling you, she got ops, bro. No, nah, Rockin' is dead ops. trash. Now, like yeah, if now people you know we we're from Rockin', but. I, when I people ask me where I'm from, I don't say Rockland. I say New York. I don't even like my area. You you might jack it. You might like that area. I'm like, from Haiti. He's the mayor. Haiti? He's the mayor of, or governor of Rockland or whatever. You're the mayor. Oh yeah, you are mayor or president for or sure some, or something. Nah, something like I just said if I ran, I know I'd win. You you definitely win. Yeah, but I don't know if you want to win that. That's True. the question. True. I'm not saying I do. I'm not saying I don't. Job. There's I'm two there's two areas and you already know the two areas I'm talking about. They're just they're they're so trash. They're probably unfixable. They're just dirty. Yeah. Yeah. I know one of the areas. I don't know what the other one's talking about. Bro, they ain't a pipe broken where, where that I can't fix. Don't no. doubt. Oh, yes, yes, yeah, yes. That, that's one. That's the other one. Where you stay at, where you lay at? No, where Dim stay at. That's the other area I'm talking about. Oh. Yeah, Dim's the area. Yeah, it's pretty trash there. Area's, area's pretty garbage. Dim's pretty garbage, too. I'm not going to lie. It's just mm-hmm. shots every... <laughs> nah, right. shots he's, everywhere. he's being hostile. Shots I love everywhere. everyone that don't piss me off. You feel me? But yeah, nah. A lot of I, fakeness in this I movie. hate you all. So goes, I probably, nah, you I'm probably get all the time, too. What? Fakeness, bro, it's actually kind of gross, and like, it's, oh yeah, and the fact that I'm seeing it, like, and, and I'm, I'm not big, but the fact I see it so early is gross, bro. Like, no, it's, but it's good that you can identify it early, you feel me, bro? Yeah, no. Nah. When I was doing my internship, bro, the swipers I was getting from people I haven't talked to in like six years—that's insane, bro. What? Like, yo, bro, you working with them? Yo, that's yo. We gotta work together. Like, no, we don't. We do not. <laughs> we do not have to work together. We will not. <laughs> nah, it's crazy. Should just be crazy, bro. Six years ago, nah. No, like dead ass, like crazy, bro. I had an ex hit me up when, uh, like I think after the kill, we blew up. Mm-hmm. Like, like a few days after that one blew up, yep. hit me up. Yep, yeah. that was pretty funny. <laughs> so I, I lit up. I'm like, you know, what? X pack, yeah. X pack, yeah. yeah. Facts. I ain't get no hit ups. That's cap. You never got some. That's definitely cap. You never got at least a couple. We know what? you did. Did I? <laughs> we don't. I don't we, remember. We, 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 we probably that. did. You got hit ups. About May what? have not wanted the hit ups, but you got them. About what? Enlighten me. I'm not gonna go into it. I'm not gonna go into it. All right, he probably knows. We'll, I'll, I'll figure out eventually. But. Bro, I'm not gonna get into it, bro. There's so many like inside jokes we know, bro. It's crazy. Oh, right, that's true. Like there's so much shit I can't even reveal in the pod. Reveal it all. This is a telltale. Uh, nah, tell all. Nah, if you know nah. what, you know what. Pause be like they be like this is a safe place. I'm like no, it's not. It's, it's gonna not get it's place. gonna get aired. We talk about safe. Oh yeah, nah. Anything, <laughs> like, anything you say, I'm not cutting it out. I'm trying to say like <laughs> it's not a safe I, I think place. I cut out like two things in this pod that both were Quan because he said some wild shit. He said some I wouldn't be surprised. Wild. Shit. You should have posted it in that nigga. No, no, I, gotten I had, canceled. No, I would have gotten canceled too, just because it's my pod. Oh yeah, wild so, as yeah. fuck. Yeah, but, nah, don't do that. Um, yo, let's boom that nigga for real though. I'm trying to pull up on him. I got his Eddie. Yeah, we we can swing, swing by. What's up with it? Oh, yeah. Juice box be hitting licks now. <clears throat> bro, when are we doing the juice box pod, bro? This you is like parties? the this is the experiment for, for the juice box pod. Bro, we whenever can do we it. Decide to do that. We can do it whenever. We can start it right now. This episode one. <laughs> this, episode <laughs> this, one. this episode one of the juice box podcast. And this episode thirteen crossover episode. You feel me? This is a, this is. I mean, this is a crossover episode. Uh-huh. I feel like we should like have a little bit more following before we do that. I agree. Right? I agree. Nah. Or we could just do it now. That's fine. Do it. Who's who, who's getting the hit ups? Look how famous. That's crazy. Bro. And I, and you're not famous, bro. It's my bro. uncle, literally. <laughs> Cap. Shout out Shamir's uncle. That's my uncle. Shout 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 out him. Big booty Jennifer. That's your uncle. That's not what it Big says. Booty. Definitely said. Oh, see you later. Nah, I, I you missed, you missed her call. It. You missed her call. You can call her later, bro. Call yeah, later. yeah. I gotta call no one. Actually, I do have to call my uncle later. I'm going to get my ass beat. 
Uncle. Uncle. But what we want to talk about, bro? What we here? What we want to talk about, man? Shit, bro. What do you want to talk about? You want to talk about life, bro? Yo, you know what, bro? I feel like something crazy is about to happen, bro. What do you mean? Like on Earth. Like you peep, like, I don't know if y'all peep, but like, you, you saw in the news where like more and more information about like aliens like definitely existing have come out. Yeah. Yeah. And like recently, like the asteroid, an asteroid hit like Texas. Yeah, there was one in the South. Another asteroid almost like hit Earth. And there's like 7,000 islands and like near like Japan's like that, water. Yeah, like that, that recently discovered. Yeah, yeah. Crazy. Crazy, bro. Like I feel like, I feel like they're like, I feel like they're slowly trying to introduce like aliens. Soon they're gonna find like an alien. I have a feeling. Yo, Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised just because like aliens could be living in our water right now. We wouldn't know because only like 90, like 5% of the ocean is discovered. Oh, less than that. Less than 5%? I think it's like 1% of the ocean. Is no, I think, it's, I think it's at least 5 I think it's a little maybe less like all right, maybe a little like three, yeah, two. Something like, something like Regardless, something. like I think I think mermaids is this too. We just haven't found them. Yeah, I believe oh, in mermaids. That's mermaids. big in like uh like Caribbean. Yeah, bro. Haitian like yeah. my parents used to tell me the folklore about mermaids all the time. Yeah. They'd be seeing them like like that, bro. I think that shit real. No, nah, it's definitely real. Mm-hmm. Yeah, bro. Yeah. You know what it is. But will will they, will they be pretty like they're on the movies though? That's the real. I question. heard that they're pretty at first to lure you in, and, and yeah. then like they show their true self and they're ugly as fuck. Yep, it's like a fish. You. Oh yeah, wow. they eat you. Yeah, yeah bro. that's really terrible. Yeah, man, you gonna have nightmares about that. It's yeah. like it's like, when you see, mermaid, it's, it's like it's like when you see a shoddy in the club and she got makeup and then mm-hmm. you take her home and then like the next morning it's a different person. Yeah, like, like that. Or like, not not, not even the next morning. Sometimes they just take all this stuff off before yeah. they go to sleep. Wait, time out. Like, are you really hooking up with a shoddy at the first meeting in the club? Yes. Who a lot of people have done that before? But like, is that some? That's a real thing. Yes. Yes. You go. Like, no, you, it's 2023. That's a real thing that people still. You go to the club. If that girl's feeling you, you feeling her, she will go home with you. Or you might link her up the, the day after or something like that. I'm just saying, like, if she takes her makeup off and it, it looks like Hey Arnold, like, you can't be surprised. Why was Hey Arnold the. Uh, I don't know. I thought example. football head. I don't mm. know why. But I mean, her head shape would be the same. It should be makeup. Yeah. I, that was uh, a bad example. It was. <laughs> and, and, what's up, and what's up with it, bro? What, what's so I bad about picking Shrek. somebody? You should have said Shrek. What's so bad about picking somebody up at the club, bro? I don't think there's a problem with it. I don't know. I just like come on, like I don't know. There's nothing. I don't think there's a problem with it. You just got to be yeah. smart with yourself. You're, You're just, just too bougie, bro. That's what it is. I'm not bougie. Yeah, sure. yeah Royce. I'm not bougie. The club. Didn't you nah. say you wanted to go to the club this weekend? Yeah, but that's different. Why is it different? I'm not intending to bring anyone. Just for fun. You never intend to. You know, you, know, you don't. You're not, you're never you go to the club to, to have fun. But yeah. then if someone's feeling you, yeah. that's, how, that's how it works. Unhand me, scoundrel. Uh, you were about to say something else. You could say it. You could curse on here. Oh, uh, word? Yeah. Slut. Nah, I'm just <laughs> wow. Yeah, bro, I'm not on the radio no more. You could curse. Oh, that's great. That's great. All that man. shit. All that shit. All that shit? Yeah, I've been saying nigga this whole time. You have, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to boom that nigga Quan. Yo, Nick you, too. You have ops. It's crazy that he I does. I used to be. I feel like I was the one with I was two that had ops, and now it's like now it's you. Now it's you. I really be more. And I I be in the cut now. You you, you have the ops now, bro. Yeah, it's disgusting. <laughs> you, nah, you no one to blame but yourself. That's you a fact. Though. That's what a mean? fact. I just be me. I wake up you're ten very, toes to the ground. Me. You're very aggressive, bro. How you're an aggressive, man. Just but, not even just the way you talk. Like right now. You have a leather jacket on, yeah, and your hands are in your pocket. Yeah, we're like I, I don't even know what's in your pocket. Like, well, right like now. we are. Don't worry about. We're in a civilized area right now. Yeah, you, you don't. You don't means. need a jacket on. Bro. What that means? <laughs> I mean, bro, you're a civilized area. I guarantee you, no one knows who you are. You can relax, my guy. You don't know yeah. that. Like, you know that picture with a little baby, and he like he has a picture. He's taking a picture with a kid, and you see the gun in his hoodie. Nah, like, that's you don't, crazy. Yeah, like you know, like bro, you don't need to be like that. Bro. You never like, know you, who's gonna bust down the door, bro. Who, my dad? Not nah, the door is locked, bro, and. Well, it's not locked. It's not locked. Well, but it, the know. three of us are in here, so yeah, like, we're all in here, bro. What's up with it? Plus, we'll smoke. exactly. The gloves are in the car. I'm always. Re- oh damn! I Plus, drive today. Yeah, I drove. The gloves today. are in my the, car. The one time I drove is, is rarity. It's crazy. Yeah, facts. Let, let's talk about gas prices. Let's talk about. <laughs> no, it, let's not talk about that. Where, that should need to go down, bro. It went down, but it needs to go down even more. Like, I'm not gonna lie. It need to go back to COVID gas prices, oh, where it was like two dollars, two thirty. So beautiful. I needed to go back to like. Before I was driving prices, I, I need bro. Remember pre COVID? I'll be complaining about pre COVID and gas would be like two seventy. Oh, I always complain about two seventy gas. During, oh, what is wrong with me? During quarantine, bro, you couldn't go nowhere, so I would just go on drives, and gas was like one oh nine. So like it wasn't even nothing, bro. Like I'll just drive, bro. Like that's those that gas prices, true. man. Crazy. 
Bring nah, I feel like we're old. We need to talk about something else. Talk about some, someone else. Nah, why are we talking about gas prices? That's crazy. Cause it's <laughs> it's disgusting, bro. So let's say there was like another like quarantine. Would y'all like mind doing another like? Oh, I'm, I already know. I, would I, already, love, it. I, I would love it. Absolutely, huh? absolutely. I would not. And the reason why I wouldn't is just cause like I think I'm at a point where I like I go link a lot of people now. Mm-hmm. Like I got I got mad people want to like make, create stuff. So like if we go on another quarantine, I'm gonna be kind of tight. Yeah, just yeah. cause that's gonna stop flows of stuff. That's Bro, I, I, I'm i indifferent towards it because I feel the same way as you. Like, um, like the shit we had planned. I remember before, like, quarantine, I forgot what we had planned, but we had a lot planned. We and that just, like, planned. went away. Yeah. Um, you know, it's funny. If quarantine never happened, I probably would have been in college dorming. That's the craziest part. That's crazy. I would have been in college dorming. Part of the plans was to go to his college. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were going right. to start public interviews then. That's when I think we were going to start. Yeah, yeah, I think you're right. I think you're right. Um, Just, yeah. But another part of me, I wouldn't mind it because one, I'm in a new crib now. I got more space, mm-hmm. and I could like a lot of content I do. I could still do, like mm-hmm. in the crib, you know. But also, yeah, them gas prices. You no know, gas, gas prices. I w- I would mind it just for the creativity side. On the yeah. other half of the side, I wouldn't mind it because number one, we're all being safe and not being dumb. Because like if it really gets that bad, yeah, shut it down. Uh, the also like the reason why I have my car now is because unemployment. And I go, like, I helped a lot. Unemployment yeah. helped a lot. Me getting my new whip. So like I know the people that my mentality thing right now like they probably can't wait to when remember we all had like a warning that we might shut down again I already know the unemployment boys yeah. they were hype they were hype because it's like six seven hundred dollars a week you're getting yep. what's crazy with ta- is, and that's with taxes taken without it, it's like a wreck what's crazy is I was still able to work so you still had to work yeah I was getting regular checks I told you I was like I bought so much unnecessary shit in oh no nah, yeah same so like <laughs> if we were if we were to happen again I'd probably start like streaming like Twitch. Oh yeah, we're that's right. probably. I, I wish I did that during like the first quarantine, but hey, um, hindsight's twenty twenty. Yeah, that's when we first started pop off, bro. We started like that. That's when because we were doing everything together. Yeah, we were only doing skits. Quarantine forced us to, to like, like split. Yeah, to split into different stuff. And that's when just I refused, crazy. huh? I refused. I don't know why, bro. Because because what? Y'all my brothers. Want to create with y'all? I appreciate. I, that. I appreciate that, bro. But you need to, sometimes you need to do stuff on your own. Because thing is like. I be, I, that's when, yeah, he's right. That's when stuff started. Like, that's when yeah. we boosted even faster, yeah. stuff like that. We started going crazy. Yeah, man. And now we're kind of back to being stagnant. That needs to change. I go lie. Yo, OnlyFans models, hit us up and you'll get in the podcast. Absolutely. <laughs> hit us up. Hit us up. Is that the case? I can know a couple girls that do OnlyFans now. Like, oh. And like, yeah. I, I generally met them. I was like, wow, that's crazy. You you can tell, like, they're <laughs> the OnlyFans about girls. There's a difference between an OnlyFans model and a girl that's OnlyFans. I know a lot of girls do OnlyFans. But successful ones. Oh, excuse me. Girl, a, lot, a bunch of girls do OnlyFans. Nah, Man. like the girl I was talking about before, she she does like um she has OnlyFans. She was in a video with Tata. Uh, oh, you probably know that. It's like a drill rapper, but yeah, she was in a video with him. I'm like, oh wow, no wonder you <laughs> you be doing something. You talking about Shadi who went to prison? That's crazy. yes, that girl. <laughs> 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 yes, that girl. Yeah, she's in a video with. I the, need her on the pod. Nah, she's actually really cool. That's it. No, I need her. Really story. Cool. I need the full story. Need the full story? I need the full story. See, I like, I didn't want to ask that because, number one, like, I there was so much happening. Bro, no disrespect. So, like, I didn't want No disrespect. I just need the full story. Need the full story? I need the full story. The scoop. She needs, he needs the scoop. I mean, I honestly, I don't know when she's going to be, and uh, next time she's going to be somewhere, but if I ever see her, I'll let y'all know. <laughs> I'll, you know. I'll ask next time I see her, if anything. Yeah, bro, she was in jail, bro. She probably beat your ass. I'm trying what? to say, but, like, yeah. Like, I'm five foot seven, bro. Like, Charlie is bigger than me. She was taller than me. Bro. She wasn't, I don't say bigger, but she was taller than me. Bro. Plus, like, she just got out, like, you just six gotta or seven months before that. I'm, I'm good what asking. You, what do you mean you just got to believe in yourself? You just got to believe in yourself. What does that even mean? Like, I cut out the like, I cut out the interview. I was, she was dead, like, I was in jail for seven years. Um... Oh yeah, I know. I, I kept I'm talking too much. <laughs> I'm talking too much. I was letting go. I was like, go ahead. Like, I'm talking too much. I'm talking. I was like, more, more, more. more. I was I was talking too much, but basically I bro. cut it out. I'm like, that's kind of personal. I didn't want to bring it up, bro. She's the one who said it. Yeah, but like, still, like, it's that's like, why are you scared. Just believe in yourself. She could have been your Krishan Rock, bro. Huh? Exactly. She could have been your Krishan Rock. So your blue face. Yo, all right, question. All right, question. Question. In your blue hoodie. Say, we place it in Krishan breakup. Okay. And she asks you out. Would you date Krishan Rock? Like, really be honest. I'm not into domestic violence. All right, but what? Keep You're in not. mind, though. Keep in mind, though. You are? Keep in mind, though. Krishan is crazy, but she's not crazy all the time. Blueface definitely antagonizes her a lot. Y'all know don't y'all know not to make a woman crazy. Yeah. 
So I don't feel like she would be as bad if she with you than she would Blueface. Because Blueface would really be wilding out. You know I would one hundred percent go on a date with her. Would I date her? No, fuck. Her. <laughs> but I would go on one date with her. You know, mm-hmm. get as much content as possible. I feel that. And then she getting blocked. Blocked is crazy. She getting blocked. Nah, honestly, nah. Because I, I feel like I'm probably the only people that think like Krishan. She's not ugly. I think she's pretty. Just she, you're, you're, you're a little insane. And that next tattoo got to go. She gonna, she, bro. She gonna, wreak, was, huh? she gonna wreak havoc on your life, bro. No, but think like your Blue, mental health. Blue is, is a crip that's dated that supposedly dated a thousand women. Just now she's she not dating someone that's gonna piss her off and antagonize her all the time. She could be dating a regular person. I think with a regular person, she'll be. I think he's wearing a blue hoodie right now. Exactly. And the thousand women. I'm not thing, a crip. I think it's pretty close to. I'm not a crip. I think Randy might have dated more. I'm not. De- <laughs> See now y'all just talking shit. <laughs> 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 They know a thousand women. No, I wouldn't even say it's crazy though. Yeah, now she definitely is crazy. But you know, yeah, no, I, okay. I'm protecting my peace. Krishan, bro, that's like, but you wouldn't make her crazy. That's what I'm trying to tell you. You wouldn't. But be she's doing already crazy, is, huh? Like, are you really prepared for like, like you get one? Like, you just got a call from your uncle, right? Like, legitimately, like, it was my as uncle. soon as it rings, bro, which is hands, hand, mink, mink, mink. Like she's she's catching with some shit. Like who is that? Like I, that's I, a head I don't hit, like, Nah, but thing is, like. All right, you know, maybe she'll be a little, little, bro, little, 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 little bro, defensive, little women, defensive. But if she keeps clocking me the way she's clocking Blueface, but Blueface is definitely. Wait, but Blue, wait, wait. Shamir's about to admit to domestic violence. Go ahead. Okay, go ahead. Why, what are you gonna say? <laughs> what are you gonna say? No, no, say it. Say no, it. Oh, let me turn. Let me turn your mic. <laughs> let me, let me, let me <laughs> let turn your mic up, all the way up. Look, my goal is to get you to get canceled today. Go ahead. Go ahead. That's crazy. No, no. If she keeps hitting me the way she hits Blueface, but Blueface makes her act crazy. Yeah. Yeah, like, good save, good save. Nah, yeah, yeah. But Blueface makes save. her act crazy. Like I've seen interviews with just her; she's fine by herself. It's when she's with him. So you think that's a problem? Him? Yeah, oh, I think it's, it's like them, them together. That, that's the problem. Yeah, I think she's when she by herself, she's alright. We're not gonna know until they break up. That's also a fact. That's what we're gonna know. That's what we're gonna. Because if she's still crazy after Blueface, then I'm like, all right, yeah, then. Well, I also think it's not just her that's crazy. I think Blueface is a crazy. Oh, no, he's crazy too. He, man's wilding, bro. He, yeah, he had, bro, I saw a clip. I saw a clip of him. He had his underwear inside out, bro. If I'm bougie and if I'm rich. I'm not having my underwear inside out. I'm not sagging. Yo, I like, what is wrong with you? Inside out, huh? I wear my underwear inside out. You do? It's a superstitious thing. All right, for, all right well, Ex- that's explain. The, yeah, I would. Yeah, like I my need underwear and undershirts. I wear them inside out, so like evil spirits don't take over my body. Are you being serious? Or are you cap I'm, cons- cons- I'm dead ass. So, so your evil underwear, spirits like so your underwear is inside out right now. Right now. So evil spirits like undershirt. pull up and they see like the Hanes tag on your shirt. You be like, oh shit, let me leave this thing alone. Yep, they can't enter. That's wild, bro. That's like that's you know, I'm like I'm that really confused. Sense. Are you being serious? Or like, or, so serious. That's like in SpongeBob with like the seat Word? there. So your underwear is under, inside out no, right bro, now, bro. Bro, yeah. remember your pants down. Yo, whoa. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Whoa. okay. <laughs> it's time for me to go. Whoa. Wait, what you said with the seat there? Yo, wait, time out. Why he lick his lips when he said whoa. that? I did not. Bro, now now you're just saying. All right. Bro, that, that's like um, remember in SpongeBob with the sea bear where they just drew the circle, yeah, and then they just stayed away from them. It's like it's like the same thing, right? That's SpongeBob. I'm talking real life. You don't it, believe in spirits? they sound equally ridiculous, honestly. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Why would, why would it, why would it, if 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 there I'm, are evil spirits, I'm which pretty, I'm not I'm not I'm not arguing there aren't, but like why would they leave you alone because your underwear is inside out? Wait, like, I'm I'm pretty. I don't think a tag is gonna stop them, bro. It's yeah. not the tag that stops them. Then what stops them? I didn't get that far. This thing is just doing it for no reason. Well, so you're right. No, seriously. Out. Since a kid. Also, I don't think Blueface is trying to keep the evil spirits away. I think he's just fucking other bitches. Yeah, I think he's fucking his bu- underwear on the wrong way. I think he's fucking other bitches and he's just a dirty nigga. Because he's a crip, bro. He, fucking, they definitely, he definitely has some dirty hood shit at some point. He's disrespected the crip community? Damn, that's crazy. I'm wearing a blue hoodie, bro. They can, <laughs> let, me, let me rock. Let me rock, bro. Wasn't you in a red hoodie yesterday? Damn, you said tripping. I was actually, <laughs> I was, but nah. Talk Look, more story. Christian, Roy, I don't think you're crazy. I think you are. Right. You got a crush on her. Chill, bro. You got a crush chill on Christian. Roy, chill, bro. gang. You got, chill you gang. got a crush on Christian. Chill, bro. I don't like. You know what, bro? I shit, man. You shit me and Christian. I shit, bro. Because look, if she, if she, you. First of all, you asked for it. Second of all, if I would, I that if it's me asking for it, that's fine. If you decide to cuff Christian, that'd be W content for us. W content. Honestly, yeah. W content. For you might you might be black and blue every time. Yeah, yeah. Like, you definitely gonna be y'all gonna be scrapping see, for sure. I'm not gonna make her crazy though. That's that's, not a, that's the one thing with me. I'm not gonna make her crazy. She's, she's already yo, wait, crazy. Let me ask you a question. Nah, let me, she no, never no, has some crazy in her. Offer, let me ask yeah. you a question. What's up? Name a time you were in a relationship 
that you didn't make your partner mad. Damn. I mean, you're we're gonna fight at some point. That's gonna be a never. Literally, like. <laughs> I know. We're gonna fight Literally. at some point. That's gonna happen. She gonna Mike Tyson your ass. Yeah, not gonna lie. You saw her deadlift three hundred. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, that's three hundred. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry, but Dude, like, she did three hundred. Blueface came with the deadlift three hundred. That nigga's knees, he was bro, he was struggling to deadlift three hundred. I was like, nah, bro, that shit was. I'm like, not gonna lie. Maybe this is why he can't lose. My guy, and I, she's fast. She used to be a Olympic runner. So I, like, I got money on Rock in a fight. Oh yeah, no, no, no. yeah. Versus you, I got fight versus mad people. Even against you, bro. I think she. I'm not gonna lie. Ooh, bro. That's a good one. I'm not gonna lie. She got you. Bro. That's a good one, you, bro. bro. She, she catch got, you with she some. Got body, you, bro. She catch you with some body shots. No, she got you, bro. I'm I eat not those. Gonna lie to you, Yum. Bro. Nah, bro. Like, Yum. She's fast know, she, too, bro. She was she out, might, she, she was out running. Well, you, oh, you saw the clip where nah. she had a football. She was out running college athletes. That's yeah. not a joke, bro. Chris, Chris, not a joke. Chris, Chris might piece you up. Nah, like, just, if she wins, I wouldn't be surprised. If you win, I'm also not surprised. But I can see her beating. That's her. a main event fight right That's there. That's a good fight. Yeah, That's, I'm trying to say. Yeah. Good Book fight. it. Book it. I ain't got yeah. no problem. Oh, so you fight women is what you're saying. That's what I'm. That's what I've been trying. That's what I've been trying <laughs> like, to see, say, bro. Equal rights. I'm not trying to fight her. Equal rights. Okay, Batman. And lefts. Okay, yeah. Batman. Okay, Batman. My hands Brown don't discriminate. He, said, he managed to say the hammer adjusts is unisex. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga said these hands are rated E for everyone, bro. Bro. E for everyone. Bro, they swing left and it's, right. It don't nah, matter who bro. it connects with. That's nah. crazy. He said these hands bisexual, bro. Hands are bisexual? Look, man. Nah. <laughs> nah, I don't agree. I don't agree. It's crazy, bro. Yo. It's, I almost yo, beat the be. shit out of a little kid over <laughs> for what? Yeah, what? Nah, cause what? Li- for what? Lil what? Man, Lil man's is looking at me like sweat beating down his forehead, like he wanted static. <laughs> you you ain't gonna look at me like you want problems. He was really standing at you for like hard. Yeah, yeah. Are you You're, sure you were just like tired from work or something? No, no. Okay, <laughs> this nigga was definitely delirious. <laughs> this little kid was just minding his business. Like, what the fuck you looking at? Like, little nigga? Trust. No, <laughs> like, no. sure, just like tired. Let me explain you what happened. So my cousin, it was her 10th birthday party, right? Mm-hmm. So she had a, so I was like, I was a chaperone or she was or whatever. Right. So I'm watching all the little kids and they running amok. And her mom had got her like, this, like <laughs> why'd you look at me like that? I can't believe this thing. No, keep going, keep going. Man. Why'd you look at me? Keep going. Nah, nah, so her mom's had gotten her like this balloon tower shit. And the kids started ripping the balloons down and started like throwing the balloons all over the place. And the mom was like, yo, Shamir. Get them kids before I get them. I said, all right. So I grabbed a balloon from dude. I was like, yo, y'all need to stop. And then they started trying to chase me down for the balloon, but I'm not trying to play this game. I just got out of work. I'm tired. <laughs> I felt right? that. So, yeah. um, I felt that. So, like, dude tries to grab the balloon from me, and he pops it. And then he was still trying to get, like, the deflated balloon. I was like, nah, I'm going to go throw this out. And, and he's looking at me, like, mad. I'm like, what's up, little nigga? Like what's up? Nah, I feel you though, cause now nah, there's times where like when I was a camp counselor, I'd be oh, oh my yeah. goodness, they want bro. I was a camp counselor for one summer. They wanted me to come back the next summer. I said no, and it was good bread. I just said no, I'm not doing it. I fucking hate kids, bro. Yo, like I, 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 I hate don't kids hate kids, I take but like if you piss me I off, we got an issue. What? I take belts off and I beat kids, bro. The fuck? I'm Haitian, bro. That's how I was raised. So I on this podcast, you, you have admitted to d- domestic violence you and, beat up and Rock. child abuse. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Bro, in the Haitian community, it's not child abuse. And they, it's, it's, it's corporate communal, punishment. It's communal it's discipline. United actually, States of actually, America. It's actually funny. I saw a clip on Instagram, and this girl, like this little girl drew, like you know when girl, like, some, like some little kid that had lipstick, she drew on like a mama's mirror. And you know like any other, any other parent would like beat the ass, but they, she's like, what do these pictures mean and everything? And people are like, that's a good thing she did that because when you beat up your kid, you make them scared. They're gonna talk to you less often, even when they're that's growing up. That's true. And I'm not gonna lie, I see the effect because I don't. That's true. <laughs> exactly, exactly a very true thing. That's why I'm like, corporal punishment does not work, gang. I feel like it's necessary in some occasions. No, 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 no. not all the time. Yeah, no, bro. it probably is necessary at some point. But like, yeah. if you if that's the way you handle, it, you get like, nah, yeah, bro, not true in general. Me. Yeah, now I'm like, but, I think gr- grounded is probably worse. To be honest, nah. Here, Here's the thing, right? If you're going to do corporal punishment, I just had this conversation the other day. Mm-hmm. If I'm mad at my child, you walk away and give him the punishment later. You don't do it in the moment because in the moment you're reacting out of anger. Anger. If you, you know, you're like, all right, you know, go sit down in the room or go in timeout for a little bit. And then later you come back and it's just like a tap on the hand or whatever it is. 
however you do it, whatever your style is, yeah. that's discipline. No, that's that's different. That's yeah, different. yeah, yeah. But that's, like even then, like, but waiting for it as a kid, like you know, and you exactly. know, it, you know that makes that's, it worse. That's what I'm trying to say. Bro, so like, that's why they're like, that's gonna they're gonna be scared of you when they're growing up. They're not gonna come to you. Nah, so, nothing, bro. No, that reminds me, nothing's worse than like you know, like you get trouble like at school or some shit, mm-hmm. and like you get that call from your parents like, wait till I get home. So like that time period of you no. waiting for them to get home, bro. Oh, the bus ride home terrifying. is the worst. It's the terrifying. Bus, bro. The bus ride home is the nothing worse than like that ride home when you know you about to get jazz beat. Yo, you ever had them waiting for you at the bus stop? Like you did that bad that they was waiting at you from the bus stop? <laughs> no, nah. mom left work Never that bad. early. Never oh that bad. my gosh, if she left work early, early. you bro. know you about to get a generational ass whooping. Bro, I'm crying right now just think about it. My eye water. Nah, bro. <laughs> they never, they never waited. They just, they just they got, they just waited like got home. And then I knew it was gonna happen. You ever got hit with like a sneak attack? All the time, bro. Yeah. Sneak attack? No. I got hit with a sneak attack, bro. All the time. All the time, bro. You think you like, safe? Like you think shit's sweet? You gonna get like a cookie or something? Like bang. Yeah. Nah. <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah. It got to a point where like they knew my parents knew, like being my ass was like they knew I liked that before, other than getting grounded. So they just started grounding me eventually because I just, then I started to go out. They're like, nah, nah, you nah, you can't go out. They were just like, you stay in your room. And they would take all my shit from me. I'm like, fuck, that's annoying, man. I'd rather just get the that ass beat. I'd rather, be, I'd rather get the ass beat and just go. Low key, yeah. I'd rather get my ass beat. I'd rather get the ass beat and just go. Because the nap sh- after? Huh? Oh, yeah, the nap yeah. after hits. I remember this <laughs> the one. The nap after? The nap after, after hits, for sure. I remember this one time I was a kid, and I couldn't fall asleep for some reason. So I looked at my dad, and I was like, yo, just beat my ass, bro. <laughs> I'm a wow. cry for a That's bit. crazy. <laughs> You're wow. not the ass game. You could have just, like, knocked over a vase or wow. something. Wow. Not, wow. I didn't, no, but it's a difference. I just needed like a quick one, two. If I broke a vase, it was gonna be like ten. Chill, chill. Yeah, nah. I'm, yeah. but like back to what you're saying. I hate when kids, because kids don't want to stop playing around. Because <sighs> I was at the pool, so like I'm a camp counselor, and like every day we have to go to the pool. And we ha- for a camp counselor, there's several rotation. Like there's some on like near the food area, some at the benches. There's gonna be three. There's, then there's three in the pool, and then there's a couple outside the pool. Like where I started, where I started, it was cold, and they started me in the shallow end. So like I would, they start you go shallow end, then you go the middle, then you have to go the deep. It's cold. <laughs> it's cold. I'm not jack. I don't. I do not want to be in the water right now. Yeah. And then they kids would start splashing you. I'm like, yo, stop doing that. Like I don't care. I'm gonna keep splashing you. I'm like, bro, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, bro. If you were lucky, this pay is so fire. I would have. Oh, I would have kicked them in the shit. Kids left. are annoying, bro. They get to a certain age, they just start trying. Like they just start like some kids are bold, bro. Like they like what like and, what and you, you like do? and you're like this pay is so good that I can't hit you. <laughs> I can't hit you because when I every time I get a five hundred dollar check every two weeks, I'm just watching you and doing nothing. Like it's fire. You know what I do? Yeah. You're just tripping. Whoops, he fell. <laughs> this nigga fell. abuses children, bro. bro. This nigga abuses bro, children. Nah, bro, just really make charging. it. Yo, no, no, make it look like an good. accident. Make it look like an accident. It, you get away with it like nine nah. times out of ten. Yeah, no, nah, and, and it was the worst part because like three write ups, you were uh, three write ups, you get fired. I was ready to write up twice by like this by the second week. So this thing was definitely tripping kids. I wasn't tripping kids. It's just like one was one was for me being on my phone. You know, both of them for being me, my, me being on my phone. Both of them for me. Yo, you're the type of person who doesn't learn your lesson. <laughs> Actually, no, no, no. The first time it was because um, some mom just didn't like me. I think she, I don't know if she raised it or not. Some mom didn't like me. I was I was first teaching. Se- I was first watching second grade. And then the mom didn't like me, so I was I was forced to get moved to fifth grade. But fifth grade, oh, that was a blessing in the skies, just because all I do is watch some hoop. Like they all they did was play ball. The yeah. second grade kids were so annoying, bro. They were so annoying. And then my, the guy who was in fifth grade got switched for the guys in second grade. I'm like, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. Kids, bro. And you know what, bro? I agree with you when you said that. Like, ass whoopings aren't always the answer. But I'll say this. When it comes to kids or anybody, some people just need the ass whooped. Oh, no. And some people need to get the ass You can beat. tell even, like, adults. Like, you can tell, like, a nigga, how a nigga talks, like, you've never gotten your ass beat. Like, no, in your life. We've we've had this conversation. Everybody come, like, by the time you're a teenager, you need to get your ass beat, like, like yeah. once. Like, you need to get... You, you need to get humbled. Like, you know when, yeah. um, what's it called? You know when, like, uh, Jake Paul and KSI were, like, they're, they're supposed to fight, like, early, early, yeah. pre-quarantine, everything? Yeah. Like... Everyone was like, Jake Paul just needs to get his ass beat. I'm like, that's someone, I'm not gonna lie, Jake Paul's a person that needs to lose. So, like, yeah. the first ego to finally, like, shut down. But I don't think, at this point, it's gotta be kind of hard. And I think Jake Paul's smart because, for one, Jake Paul's actually good. He's not the best boxer in the world. Like, he's not as good as Canelo, you know, them niggas. But he's, he's got, actually a good boxer. I think that's what Now, yeah, he's definitely a good boxer now. He has great fundamentals, and he's, like, picking the perfect opponents. That's the other part yeah. of it. Because he, he's good, he has power. 
but he's picking he's picking opponents that he knows he could beat. Yeah, like he bro, he fought Nate. But I don't but, but I don't know why Nate wanted to fight him so bad. What, what bro, why did Nate want to fight him? It's so over bad? for Nate Robinson, bro. I saw this recently, bro. Yeah, I'm following my G after that after that knockout. Bro, it Jeez. was I think it was a post about like Lonzo Ball. And it was like Lonzo Ball shut down for the season. And, yeah. Nate, and Nate Robinson commented down, damn, what injury did he have? All the comments like, man, shut your ass up, nigga. You got knocked out by Jake Paul. One nigga was like, I'm surprised you're awake. Like, <laughs> they're going in on Nate Robinson. Nah, bro, bro for like, a week straight, every all his comments like, Nate, you're, you, I'm surprised you're awake. You're awake, bro? Yo, some people just, just can't let him live, But, like, bro. thing is, like, why... Why do you want to fight Jake Paul so bad? Some people just want to fight him for some reason. I'm like, why though? Jake Paul, I mean, like, Jake Paul thought. He, I mean, uh, we knew who Jake Paul was. Nate, Nate thought, was like, yeah. "Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fuck this Disney kid up." Yeah, he fucked around and found out. Bro, slept. That's how it is. Slept. But yeah, social media is on his ass, bro. I've never seen social media something like. Oh yeah, Nate Robinson had. You probably went rare. through hell for like a month. That hell, my month. Was probably, I mean, he probably still is because like. Oh yeah, no. Nah. Some people like. It's just on site for you every time you say something on social media. It yeah. reminds me of remember when the Twenty One Savage shit was going on? Yeah, when they found out that he was from uh, the UK. UK, yeah, bro. Demi Lovato, I think all she tweeted was like, "This Twenty One Savage shit is crazy." And we're talking about crack. Her right? comments like, "The fuck up, you crack whore, crack like, cocaine wild yeah. shit." To the point where she deleted her Twitter. Yeah, damn, like ruthless, bro. Ruthless. Oh no, no. The internet is really like crazy. The internet is really crazy. It's crazy, bro. It's crazy. Especially if you have like if you are uh, like especially if you're an artist, if you have a cult following. Yeah. Like yeah. anyone that says anything negative about you, they're gonna be on your ass. That's one thing. Yep. One people that they ride for like, X X's fan base wrote for him. That's one thing. Yeah. They wrote for him. Cause there's one guy, he was like in the final of the reaction, and he's like, Yo, I know what you're talking X, about. X is trash, like I don't like him. Bro, everyone was like, "Say kill yourself in the comments." Yeah, like, it yeah, was. Yeah. It was even like the no, like making fun. They were just like, "Bro, kill yourself." Like that. Also, fun. you know what added to it? Uh, I am Dante. I'm Dante. He yeah. reacted to it. And he was like, "Yo, fuck this nigga." Oh like, yeah, I Dante didn't make it easy. He didn't make it. He didn't make it yeah. easy. But thing is, like, he was like, "I hate this mumbling rapping stuff." And it was, uh, you know, the song Hope. X. Yeah. That's the song that he was listening to. I'm like, you're not listening to the song. That's not a mumble song, bro. Like, yeah, it, it, that made it worse. I'm like, you're not even. You don't even know what you're talking about either. X had a lot of haters too, though. He did. Complicated you think, character. You really think Drake killed X? Because that's what everyone's be saying. I don't. I don't think it's true. I don't think it's true. I think that every ten years the, the Illuminati needs another sacrifice. It was X's time. Well, that was dark. That was dark, but that like, was really dark. Sad man. I don't. I don't think that Drake killed X, but I. I think Drake knows that people think that he killed X. Yeah. Because for sure. like that that line he had like on BS. If he, I, I know, but I'm upset. Is no, it? it's not, not. I'm upset. Oh, it's not that one. It's on BS. It's, it was on her loss. I think the line was something to the to the like to the likes of like, um, if 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 he held his tongue on that live, he'd be alive again. Because oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like back in like I think it was like 2018. X yeah. was like, if if I die, Drake did it. And he was talking shit about Drake on his IG live. So Drake said some funny shit. Like he, he likes to do like. No, Drake is a petty nigga. Drake's honestly. petty. But the thing is, Drake is smart petty. He's not going to talk about it at all. He's only going to talk about it through his music. Yeah. He doesn't talk about it anytime after that. How crazy would it be if Drake killed X, though? What's the reason? <sighs> well, I mean, they, I don't even know why they had beef, but just, like, imagine the scenario Drake where... Drake stole, like, X's flow. And Drake he stole... He did, he did. Drake stole X's flow, and out of any artist that ever Drake stole, like, the flow or, like, took up someone's flow, that's the only person that checked them on it. No We're one else... True. Che- what? X is the only one. Soldier? <laughs> <laughs> the second. Young right? Draco. Thank you. The second. The second. I'm sorry. The second. You, know, the second. you are absolutely right, yeah. Shibi. I'll yeah. give you that. I'll yeah. give you that. So the boy is the first person uh, to like. Big soldier. Big soldier. Big yeah. Draco. Big Tell Draco. me no. what's really going on. Just get back in a minute. I'm ready. What's, what's happening? happening? Soldier. Oh. Nah, but. Young Draco. How crazy would it be if. The biggest artist in the world, Drake, mm-hmm. killed X, who possibly could have like took over that. It's really crazy because, bro, he was making, he was going numbers. Look, Everything I, sold. I don't know if he would ever take Drake's spot. But he, definitely, he definitely, he definitely would have been like top five, top ten. Oh, I don't and, like, right now, hundred percent. I don't think he would have take Drake's spot like with like mainstream popularity, but streams, no question. I think because X's fan base is already crazy, and I feel like even though I didn't think his music was like. All his music was like that crazy. Yeah. I feel like he was getting up to like. That, he was like, getting better. 
Because yeah. he had variety. He had so much versatility in his music. Yeah. So he was getting better. And Question Mark was a great album to like really break him out. I feel like he was low-key like... It's a crazy comparison, but he's kind of like the Tupac of our generation, like, generation a little bit. Or how he died so early? How he died so early and how like much of an influence he has. Yeah, not, no movies, you, could, you could tell it's, you could tell it's influence like a year or two later. That's why, like... Because before, like, um, X... Screamo rap wasn't really a thing where you just scream into the mic like that wasn't that was a th- screamo was a thing but like screamo rap wasn't and that yeah. he was really like starting that and then like that's what you yeah. hear like other people do that now and then like you got Juice World Juice World got a lot of inspiration from X too Juice World was dope too yeah but yeah X I like the screamo rap for sure but I also like when he was like you know his Jocelyn Flores shit too. yeah he, that was hard too cool. man X could rap bro X he, he was really, really versatile rap. Joey Badz him was to drop a tape. That would have been so fire. Infinity 88 is such a good song. <sighs> That's my favorite X song. That's your favorite X song? That's one of my favorites, too. Yeah. One of my favorites, too. That shit's so fire, bro. Sometimes you got to catch committee on these niggas. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, you, shit. sometimes, sometimes you got to catch them. Like, their tape would have been heat. Yeah, yeah, yeah it would have been Their fire. tape would have been good. And that's when, like, Joey wasn't even, like, washed. <laughs> Joey's washed now? <laughs> would you say? I, I'm not going to lie. The, his last album was not That shit was booty. I would say booty. I want to say booty. It just wasn't. That was a It wasn't fest. amazing. Did you hear it? Yo, All right, we got the mid button. Mid, <laughs> mid. I have it. Joey Badass's out last album or Ice Spice's EP? Ice Spice's EP, one thousand. I'm not gonna lie. Yes, one thousand percent, bro. Bro, I think it was Bikini bad. Bottom. Was, Ice Spice has done more for New York rap than Joey Badass has ever done. Wow, I hate how he's like. Wow, I hate how that's. Bro, just, I wow. hate. I uh, spice up next, re- bro. And you know what? I hated at first. I hate how you can really argue that. It's so stupid. I hated. I hated at first. Actually, that, was, that might have been Cap. But I hated that no, first. No, I'm not going to lie. Ice Spice, bro. She real. No, she's she nice. Real. Like, Ice Spice, these female rappers coming up now are all pretty solid. I can't even lie. Like That Ice Spice Pink Panther song going crazy. Yeah. You know what's crazy? There's a universe where Randy went to purchase, bagged Ice Spice. Oh, she would go to purchase. Oh, Is yeah. She, oh, and she's 20. Wait, that's where you're supposed to go, right? I'm supposed to go to senior purchase. So if COVID never happened... You would have went to the same school as Ice Spice. I would have went to the at the same time. Yep. So you, you could have bagged Ice Spice. Yep. You could have bagged Ice Spice. You could have bagged. Yep. 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 <laughs> COVID strikes again. Yep. Damn. Damn. What could have <laughs> been? Why are you coughing? Huh? Why are you coughing? I ain't cough. I ain't cough, bro. I ain't cough. Sorry, man. Let it out. Nah, bro, because she's dead 23. I'm 23. It's annoying, man. It's meant to be. It's meant to nah. be. I love my girl. That's what. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I love my girl. Oh, oh my, god. my god. Okay. Um. Where? What's her name? That's a lot of questions. Lot he of is. Questions. Yeah, that is a good question. A what, what's her name? That's a lot of questions, my boy. Next topic, dude. Damn, you don't claim her for real. I do claim her. Um, okay, so we don't have any new music. It's been kind of slow for the music so far in 2023. Yeah, uh, I mean... Yeet album coming out soon. Yeah, yeah, Yeet drops Friday. I love Yeet personally, but... I'm gonna know. listen to it, bro. And you know what? I'm gonna listen to it with open ears. Because I'm not a... You know I'm not a Yeet fan. Yeah. Now, I understand why people don't like Yeet. Like, you're not the first person to say I don't like Yeet. If it's good, though, it's good. I'll admit. Like, he's very hit or miss. That's, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Because it's, it's his beat. Like, the beats... Their beats are very good. Like, that's one thing. The beats are 10 to 10 most of the time. It's just like, yeah, some there's some times I'm like, I'm not feeling this. Yeah. I feel that. Um, let's get into some nerd talk though. Um usually we talk about Marvel and DC, but I wanna I wanna talk about Avatar, bro. Because oh, oh, the yeah. blue people? La- no, not the blue people. Not that one. The last airbender. The real Avatar. Let's talk about the it. The last airbender, let's my talk boy. About it. So we got some new Avatar series coming out in 2024. We got the Kiyoshi movie. That one's gonna be so fun. 2025, we got the Prince Zuko movie, and then 2026, we have the Korra movie. So, do you do you guys know any info about this? I only seen that basically. So, I don't want to really know about anything until it comes out. Is the yeah? Because I was about to say, is the so I want to know. Obviously, the Zuko movie is pre Avatar, right? Or is it post? It's, it's post. It's the it's last w- Airbender. It's, it's, it's post War. Fire Lord. I oh, think, so it's him as Fire Lord. Okay, oh, so it's like a okay. dope. I think it covers like him redeeming the Fire Nation. Copy. Oh, that's fire. I want to see what happened to Azula too because what happened to her? Oh, that story I, is fucking wild. So you it's know good. it. I don't know the movie, but I know like post what happens with Azula. 
Is she like like banished or something? She's probably in prison. That's what I assume. Yeah, that's what I assume. Talk to you guys about it? Yeah. I want to talk about it? All right. It's spoiler. So, um, I'm not going to remember this in two years, bro. All right. well, <laughs> yeah, facts. Way. Okay. So, um, the creators made comics after the series mm-hmm. that covered it. And Zuko and Azula go on an adventure to find their mom. Really? Really? Yep. And they find So, she's her. not in jail. No, uh, she was, but Zuko went with like the entire Avatar gang. And he was like, you know what? This is my, this is our mom. So come with it. So Z- wait, so they went. Oh, it, so it was crazy. Zuko, Azula, and like yeah. Aang and all them. Yeah, I would not trust Azula. Bro. I yeah, don't I care. wouldn't that's either. My sister, bro, Azula's insane. Like but no. that's why he brought the rest of them because they could easily overpower him. I still wouldn't. I still wouldn't trust. Nah, Azula, are you bro? sure though? Because like, bro, there's even early when when Azula's sane. That's a different story because nope. Azula, when she was sane, she escaped from all six of them, mm-hmm. which is crazy. Yeah. She like does how do you, escape, huh? She does escape because eventually, um, the objective is for Azula to kill Ursula, and for Zuko and the rest of them just to find her. Oh, so her objective is different. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. I don't know. Azula is like, I think honestly, if you really keep it a buck when it comes to villains in Nick, she might be the best one. Oh, in Nickelodeon, hands down. She, yeah, she might be the best one. Just because, yeah. like, she's both. She's more scarier than the Fire Lord. The Fire Lord, you don't, you just hear about him. You don't really hear see him till yeah. the fight. Yeah. But Zula, like that's she's constantly on your ass the entire series. That's gonna be dope. I think Zuko is probably one of like the most complex characters in Avatar. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, at least the sure. last Airbender. Yeah. So sure. no, across all the universes, easily. No, for sure, because like yeah, I think so. No, for sure, because like bro, you got the. The scar, you're, he had to fight his own father, and obviously he's not going to fight his own dad, so yeah. he just he just took it. it. So, there's also a Korra movie. That's 2026. Do you know if that's post? Uh, it's post that series. Post The Legend of Korra. Yeah. It might cover from, I remember reading somewhere that it might cover, like, because at the end of The Legend of Korra, her and, um, I forget the girl's name. Yeah, she, she, she was, she was on her, uh, she doing her lesbian shit. Yeah, they go to the spirit world. Yeah. So I believe it's going to cover that. That's interesting. What, that could be logic, interesting. Yeah, logically, I think that's what it would cover. Those both sound dope, but... I'm really excited about Kyoshi. The Kyoshi movie going to be fire. I'm really excited about that. That's going to be fire. Yeah. So is that... Do you know if that's post... I mean, Kyoshi's pre. Because she's before Act. She's before yeah, it, It's So it's about the Kyoshi avatar. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that's oh, all. Right? Yeah. That's, that's awesome. hard. Yeah, because like, yeah, she's pre. Yeah, she's pre. Aang. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be fire. She was the Earth Bender before Aang. That's gonna be fire. That's gonna be so fire. Yeah, that's gonna be really fire. And then there's there's another series coming. Yeah, there's a series with the. Um, it's a new Avatar series that's post Aang and post Korra. Yeah, and it's it, animated. Yeah. Oh, really? It's gonna yeah, be a it, new Avatar. Yeah, it's the new Avatar. The next Avatar in the so that would be Earth Earth. Bender. Yeah, yeah, Earth. Yeah. I'm so glad they're continuing this shit, bro. But. He doesn't have access to the other avatars. Why? Because that's weird, though. Wouldn't you be able to have no, the access? She he only has access to Korra. Okay, really? All of this is spoilers. If you haven't finished Korra, so I think it was season three. Um, y'all know about Rava? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rava dies. Uh huh. If mm-hmm. you remember, mm-hmm. yeah. So when Rava dies, all the previous avatars die with Rava. So Aang is gone too. Aang is gone. Kyosh, damn. They're all gone. So this new avatar only has Korra to go back on. Damn. And that's literally the worst avatar. <laughs> I'm not saying she's the worst. She lost to every single villain she fought. Name a villain she beat. She she Korra got she folded was, a lot. Korra, yeah. Season she one, I'm on one. He stole her bending. She only she only got away because she unlocked her airbending because she lost all of her other bending. Yeah, I guess. But I wouldn't say she's the worst. She's because, like, the time is different compared to all the other avatars. Her time is a lot more advanced, a lot more bending, a lot more powers, a lot more people. I'll, I'll give you that. No, season two? Like, she Aang, didn't listen Aang to was her simple. father. Season two, she um, she could have avoided the entire conflict of season two if she listened to her father, who was telling her, don't trust my brother. Yeah, I don't know. And what that's, what, that's what caused Rava to die. I honestly don't get why you think that Korra would be Aang, bro. I think Korra could be Aang. Bro, there's no Korra, way. I think Korra could be Aang. Aang. I think no Korra way. could be Aang. Only, be, I'm like... Only I, has brute strength over Aang. Yeah. And 
That's and that's and, and you're not even she's, comparing. She's better, than, to she's better at three elements than Aang. No, she isn't better at three elements she than is. Aang. She just learned them faster than Aang. She's better than them than Aang. No, Aang, she isn't. Uh, so you're telling me Aang is good at earth bending? Yes. No, he's yeah. not. Yes, he <laughs> no, he's yeah, not, he is, bro. bro. No, yeah, he's he not. No, he's not. He struggled for so long to learn that, bro. He's well, technical difficulties. Crazy. What, what were we talking about? Um, Korra. Yeah, yeah Korra is fading. Aang. Nah, and she's not. But the thing is, like, and the reason why I say this because y'all saying before Korra got an ass beat, the few times Aang has got hit, that nigga gets sent far as fuck, and the, there's few times where he's gotten hit and he's fucking fell down. No, to you're the talking ground. about a twelve year old Aang. Yeah, that's fine. We're talking about we're comparing twelve year old Aang to sixteen year old Korra. Yeah, we're talking about at the ending of the shows. At the ending of the shows, I got Korra. If they're adults, then it's a completely different story. No, at if, the ending of the show, it's definitely Aang. Nah, no, nah, I it's think definitely so. Aang. Because definitely, what's, what's the key word you just said? Few times Aang's got hit. You don't get Aang hit. is yeah, really good. The thing is, yeah, Aang's not going against a fucking Avatar. Now we're going against an Avatar. This and, is but, different. But regardless, too slow. yeah, huh? regardless, Aang is really Aang, good at not getting hit. All right, cool. But how is Aang gonna? You can only run away for so long. Is Aang gonna hit her? And if, yes. Aang, and if, yeah. Aang, if, Aang, if Aang hits her, I know she's gonna be fine because she's gotten hit before and she's been grounded. Aang, if he gets hit, how many times Korra get her powers? To, uh, get her ability taken? Those are different people. Those are different people. Like those are different people. They, she just figured out that shit that powers again. My God, she got her bending taken away by someone who just used water bending. Who just used water bending? All right, but Aang is a master. What took him two days to master water bending? Yeah, yeah, because air and water are very close to each other. Exactly. That, that's lie. why it was easy for him to learn that shit. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like every episode of Korra, Korra meets someone, gets fucking her ass beat, and then comes back and beats her the second time. So I, yeah, I think Aang folds her. I'm not gonna lie to you. Nah, I think Aang is too so. nice with it. I think he's not. I, I don't think Korra touches Aang. I think y'all, if you think Aang does not get touched once or twice, you I are really crazy. You are crazy. And the time, you know, those He'll hits probably are gonna, get touched those, once. Those, no, those once. hits are gonna hit too because Korra is strong. Those are gonna hurt. Aang got hit into but, a wall and okay. passed out <laughs> wow. when they're when they're trying to get the drill in. Zula hit him and he passed out after we got to get hit back. Up okay, but the then wall. he got up and won that fight, right? No, he got up and won the fight because. Fucking um, they stopped the train, so it caused him the train to shake. So he woke up, and then he ran up the wall. He didn't hit her. He went up the wall, and she missed attacking him. So she they broke the drill. She didn't, he didn't actually physically attack her. Yeah, he did. When he hit the thing, the fucking shockwave knocked her off. Yeah, that's yeah, not a physical attack. I'm talking about yeah. He stopped the drill. Just he didn't actually he... hit her. He stopped the drill, and that pushed it back. My guy, his strategy was to stop the drill. Yeah, yeah, that's a strategy to stop the drill. But I'm talking about it. We're talking about a one on one fight. I don't think Aang, one on one. Aang, nah. Aang is one. smoking Carol. Yeah, I, promise I don't it. think so. I, I don't think that. like I. I think honestly, I think Aang doesn't get hit, and I think that he 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 hits Korra with some shit that will like knock her out for a little bit. I don't think and so. it'll be into the fight. I don't honestly. think so. If Korra gets hit, I know she'll be all right. Aang get hit once, twice. I'm not sure he doesn't go fine. Wait, why are you sure? I th- your logic is that. Core will be out because she's taking hits, but every time she's taking hits, she's been like fucked up, like down for a long time, got her bending taken away. I gotta remember the she time just, she, down she, for a long, long time. Yeah, I, I remember Aang getting sent to fucking, fucking stratospheres and shit. Like, okay, yeah, he gets blasted then, then he gets and sent, sent back, but like, but not. I'm talking like far. <laughs> like I'm talking, didn't get that far. Yeah, because he's been hit with stronger attacks than Core has. Oh no, 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 Mister Boom Boom, the dude with the. That nigga was tough. Oh, Zula, yeah, no, that, that's Zula's that's tough. Zula's yeah, Zula, tough. Zula, Zula's, Zula's tough. tough. Zula's, that's one of the fights I'm talking about. Is Zula. Yeah. When yeah. He, got, he got sent. He got sent. Yeah. Korra ain't but fight, oh, Korra's yeah. strong. I think Korra's the enemies she's fought are stronger than Zula, though. A lot, of, a lot of them are stronger than Zula. Maybe one. What do you mean, maybe one? Maybe one. Who would that be? Uh, What's the face? Unalak. Oh, yeah. I'll tell you this, though. Korra, if we're just talking about the shows, Korra has some. Fire villains, bro. Some really fire villains, bro. Zaire is the best villain. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. Unalak was probably the worst villain. And he yeah. was, like, strong as hell. Yeah. But the first dude in the mask was crazy. Amon. Yeah, Amon no, was, was crazy. crazy. He Z- beat Zaire Korra. was crazy. And that Shardy in the fourth season was tough, too. She was the worst villain that season. I don't know, bro. She was the worst villain. She almost won. She, she did almost win. But, again, that's a weakened Korra. True, true, true. You know, you're, you're, right, you're, right, you're, right, po- you're right, you're right, you're right. She had poison in her system. You're right, you're right, you're right. I'm glad they're um they're starting up again with new avatar though, bro. Yeah, but it just sucks that all he has is Korra. She sucks. No, Korra does not suck. She y'all drag sucks. y'all dragging it. And, and we were talking about the time Aang almost got beat. The only re- time he, the only reason why he beat the Fire Lord is because he that the fucking point in the rock hit the one spot where made him wake up the Avatar state. If that's not the case, that, that nigga's losing that fight. 
That sounds like accuracy to me. No, he got pushed back. That's the he got lucky oh, that, that oh, hit. That's luck. That's yeah, yeah, lucky that, that it, was it wasn't luck. luck. It was it luck. luck. It he was, got pushed back. It was the perfect so, defense. No, how's the defense? He got and hit. then he said, "You know what? I'm tired of being on defense. It wasn't Let me defense. go on to offense." It wasn't perfect defense though because it was a uh, what's it called? Ozai threw fire at him. It went through all the rock he had behind him, and then he had air left, and he was getting pushed back. And the only reason why he bought the Abyss State because the rock hit him right in the one point he needed to wake in the Abyssar State because he couldn't go in the Abyssar State before that because Azula fucked him up. This nigga is the Skip Bayless of, of Ang, bro. Fast, like bro. He, he is to Ang what Skip is to LeBron. Nah, that's actually this nigga crazy. Hates Aang. This nigga hates. Nah, Aang, bro. I like Ang, but I'm talking about if we're really talking about one v one fight, I got Cora. I, I feel like y'all. Him. I feel like y'all really sleep. Cora get fucked up. I really. I just think Cora gets hit too Cora. often. Then she gets hit too often, bro. No, that's true. That's true. I'll give you it's that. Just, it, it's, it's tough, though. You know, they, exactly. they're both tough. I just see the, 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 the time. I'm not saying the times the get hit, it's like it's bad. Okay. Like, it's rare, but it's bad. I think it's worse than Corbin. Okay, but here's the thing. Bad. Aang has only really lost one fight against Azula. Yeah. Cora has bunch. lost fights against every major villain. What fight are you fought. talking about with Azula, though? Which one? The one where she shoots the lightning through his back. That's the only one where it was definitive. Oh, that one. Loss. You're talking yeah. about it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. it. Any other one, it's up. either he's won or it's just been like a stalemate. Azula escapes and just leaves like. Yeah, the most time they're, yeah, the most time they're stalemates. Exactly. Most time they're stalemates. Yeah. And technically, the stalemate is a W for Aang because his objective is always get out. Yeah. So. Yeah, but like that's what I'm saying. Like. I know. I think. I think in a one v one fight, like a fight, fight. Yeah, no, I got Cora, bro. I do think that Cora's competition was a little tougher, a little bit. Like you got you got Azula, but what else? Like what else? Ang really fought that's like who, who that did, who did Aang You got King. Yeah, yeah. Old King Boomy. You got uh. Oh, he, he, he fight, backed up uh, Admiral Zhao. Yeah, Admiral Zhao. Yeah, he Zhao. Yeah, yeah. Up. yeah. Old King Boomy. Yeah, Admiral Zhao. You got uh. Is that really? No, no there's definitely more. Sparky, fucking, Sparky, Boom Man. That nigga was tough, don't lie. <laughs> Sparky, Sparky, Stupid name, but that nigga was tough. Sparky, Sparky, yeah. boom, man. Then you, got the, then you got the Fire Lord. But other than that, it's just regular enemy. Packed and up I, the Fire Lord. He pa- bro, the point. Packed up the but like, Fire we're, 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 Lord. No, bro. He did. The, the point. The okay. point, bro. Okay. He would have lost the fight. Okay. Packed he would have lost up. the fight, though. I'm about to say. And I'm then a, when they. But also, he didn't, though. Huh? But he didn't, though. Yeah, because of luck. The, yeah, the one point that he needed to. The waking up, yo! You remember that one crazy, time bro. you you was driving and then you almost hit a car and you're like, "But I didn't though." <laughs> also, sense. before when uh, uh, the father got his Benny taken away, he almost took Ang's Benny away. No, he didn't. Yes, he did. The, it was red and blue, and it was going towards red. Like he's and was about to lose, and Ang just twit. Tied up at the end, which is low key plot armor, but no, we let that rock. No, it's not plot armor. It's <laughs> that Aang was doing something. Clutch. That's called clutch. Aang was low, doing something that he had never done. Low key before. plot armor. Bro. It's, it's not low key we're plot armor. We're gonna let it rock. Okay. It's, it's called learning a new power <laughs> on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but I'm, I'm hyped to see new Avatar, bro. So I think it's um like the creators, the original creators are like a part of it. So yeah, oh, it's original creators. It should right. be good. I'm really hyped for that Kyoshi movie. But speaking of Avatar, how do you feel about the live action? Ugh, bro, I'm not I, talk, it's I a Netflix original live action. Okay, but here's the thing: the creators were on I'm, board for the beginning. Oh, you talking about the new one? Yeah, the one that's coming out now. Yeah. <sighs> no, not, not, not the old. The, no, I'm not talking about the old. That's, that's, that's what I was about to no, say. No, the new one. The new I'm one's just, coming out. I don't. Right. I'm just not a fan, bro. I'm not. I'm just not a fan in general of them taking cartoons and making it live action. The it only time be. I've seen that work is like Scooby Doo. Nah, I figured out parents did it with chat with Drake that and Pana. Drake and Pana. Drake, Drake, Drake and Pana did not no. pull that shit off. No. Nah, yes, Drake and Pana did it. Nah, Drake and Pana did it. Wait, 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 wait. Daniel Monet, Monet, bro? Daniel Monet is fine. And this nigga just said Daniel Monet like she was Beyonce, bro. Like she okay. Nah, Danielle She's not going to say Danielle Danielle Monet is bad, though. She not gonna Danielle see the movie. Pretty. Still ass, huh? The movie was not the fair eye parents movie. It was good. It was no, good. I know what Dan- Danielle Monet the, looks like. No, even Trina. The fair, Trina. the fair eye parents. No, but they, it's older. She when she's older now though. It's like after Victoria. So she yeah, no, I know. I've seen it. I've seen but it. That shit mid. The movie was good though. Fair eye parents was good. That's that's the only I, good. I, that's the only, only one I can think of. Right, the, right the, the only though. good live action I've seen that came from a cartoon is Scooby Doo movies. Nah, you don't. I mean, yeah. Besides the fair eye parents, I can't really think of anyone right now. Uh, live action. Thank you. Damn. Yeah, I, I don't know. Because I already know Dragon Ball was not good. This uh, Anime live action is really good. It's clipped. I already know that. I know, but I know what she looks like. Stop bro. it. I know nah, what damn. she looks like, bro. It's like... Look, nah, Danielle Monet... Stop it. Like, bro, besides Kat, I thought she was too. I, I thought she was better. Nah, then, she's not then, 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 Jay, then Jay blew up. 
And then, Bro, then, I, then I had your three. We're talking about shotties from Victorious. I don't know if Ariana's number one. I might have Ariana's Jade. Number, Ariana's number one. I might have Jade number one. No, you're thinking of the last two seasons of Jade. Season one and two, Jade was mid. That's like goth Jade. That shit like a little streak of like... But... Okay, the, fine. Uh, I'll, I'll go Ariana. Mm-hmm. I'll go Kat. I'll go Jade. Yeah, I'll put Jade to you. Then Trina I got Trina. Tori? That's what I put. That's what I, that's what I think. I If you put Jade Co-signing? over Kat, though, I'm not, I'm not upset with that either. If you're talking about like season three and on, I'm not upset with that either. I don't know what it was about Daniel Monet. Daniel Monet was bad. I you like, got Trina number one? Yeah, nah, number over, one. Over every I'll respect it. Over I'll respect it. I respect it. Crazy. I respect, nah, Daniel Monet is bad. She, also, she was also the original Cloud Chaser. Girls don't know that. She was Selena Powell. Before Selena Powell could walk, bro. Yeah, she, she was crawled. definitely the PG version of Selena Powell. No, for real, but you, you hear a record label, she would run. That's a fact. <laughs> I'm trying to say, bro. And I'm not going to lie. She probably was like, her and Kat were... Actually, I'm be honest with you. Well, Kat, Her, talent, Kat and though. Jade, all three were great actresses in that. Yeah, Tori was okay. You know, like I say it every time, Victoria Justice was the worst girl on that show. I think they really set Victoria Justice up for failure, just because like she was a she was a good singer. She was a pretty good no, actor. She, no, she was not a good singer. She was a good singer, bro. No, she, she could was sing. Not. She was no, a good. No, she, she, bro. Sing. she was no, a good singer. She, don't it's don't just, do that. No, no, no. She's she, she's don't a good singer. That. I'm telling you, I'm, listen to her bro. and like live. No, no, no. I'm gonna tell you what it is. I'm tell you what it is. She's a good singer. It's just she got put next out. to hey. Ariana Grande, oh. who's a generational singer. I'm telling That's you, what it is. It's, bro, you got that one song. I can't even think of the title right now from Victoria Justice. Bro, Freak the Freak Out. I wasn't even thinking of that one. It was something else. She had a song that went charts, uh, Victoria, uh Tori. I forgot her, but I forgot the name of the song. There's one song that went charts. I'm telling you, if you watch, if you listen to a live concert, oh, she's oh. not good. And one she's day. Not. You'll be begging. Yeah, I, that one, yeah. That shit, that shit went hard. That, shit that one, like 50 right. in the chart, like how 100. Bro, that song that song was hard. Bro, that seventh grade me was going through it. That song but, but pulled me through. I'm saying that like she was like she wasn't terrible, but the fact that she was the star of the show and like she really got carried by the rest of her cast. You know what? It so was? I think no, I did. think that because they tried to make her the star, mm-hmm. you really just set her up for failure. You know why? Point. Yes, I agree. Because after Zoe 101, they wanted to put the rocket ship on her. They're like, yeah, yeah that's yeah. what it was. Yeah, and plus, they couldn't yeah. do it with Zoe. I, they couldn't do it with Zoe for obvious reasons. Mm-hmm. Fuck Dan Schneider. And Quinn was not better than Victoria Justice. They, uh, they, Quinn was not better than Victoria yeah. Justice. No, she was not. <laughs> like, no, no, I she, feel like no, that's she a was, discussion that could be no, had, she was my not boy. What are you talking about right now? I feel like that's a discussion that Quinn could be had. Quinn Pensky? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, she was not. It's crazy. Nah, she was the, she was the baddest one. Notice who Logan came. bagged. Huh? Billionaire bad boy. Logan Reeves. It's, <laughs> bro, Logan, Logan, no, Logan bro. is the GOAT. I can't even lie. Logan is who I aspire to be. That nigga's just some rich bro, boy. That nigga's gross. What the are you dick, talking he about? He's a dickhead. He's, he's a rich nigga. He's a dickhead. <laughs> Look, hilarious. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy. Nah, but. She's not bad at the Victoria Justice, though. They, they took the better girl, then they wanted to make that the next show. And yeah. That obviously didn't it's work just, out. Yeah, also, Victoria, was, she was a diva. That's what yeah. they said. Like, Bonnie, like, yo, she was acting like mad. This is my show, like, blah, blah, shit like was that. She? Yeah, she was. It was really Andre's show, but that's not... That's it's not re- it really was Kat's show. I think everyone knew it was Kat. Actually, no. Andre was the most entertaining character. It was he Kat Andre? that show. Kat, Andre, and Jade, I think, and Sinjin. I know, it was Andre, Black Hair And Trina. Nah, no, it was Andre, Black Hair Month. It was Andre. It's Andre. Andre. Uh, March first is still gonna be Andre. Like, don't hit me with the last nah. Month. Uh, nah, <laughs> <laughs> nah, if you really give it a buck, though, it was Kat, it was Trina, Andre. and it was Sinjin. And Andre. But I'll give you something. Uh, Andre, bro, like, Andre was all right. But no, he, he, he wasn't, he wasn't that funny, though. What? Not You're really, crazy. bro. Not really, bro. bro. Anytime he had to talk about his grandma, yeah, sure. that nigga was His stressed. grandma was funnier, though. Like, no, his, his, that his nigga girl. was stressed. Because his grandma was, he was crazy. He was stressed. He was crazy. But Sinjin, Sinjin had me weak. Sinjin was, was cringy. Sinjin disgusting. was hilarious. Cringy. Shout out my man Sinjin, bro. I don't know how we got to Victorious from Avatar. Um, you know, that's a great... Great point. I have That's no great. idea how we made that. Wait, that is a great question. I don't know. What else is there? Oh, yeah. Are y'all excited for a new season of Invincible? Dude, when does it drop? Oh, my God. Please drop soon. They confirmed that it'll drop at the end of this year. You know what's crazy? Mark might be the only person who got clapped more than Cora. Yeah. yeah. I do not agree with that. Mark really Grayson. God, Fucked up. Yeah, fucked up. No, Mark's a loser. That's yeah, the one thing about he is, he's he pretty much a loser. Like I was, I was watching it, and I'm like the first few episodes. I'm like, bro, does he really get his ass beat this much? And you know what's crazy? Like I kind of know what happens next. It gets worse. 
Yeah, I know, I know. I learned. He's about to get clapped, literally. Yeah, yeah. Jacob told me. <laughs> oh, He's about to it's Jacob, about to get real rough for Mark Grayson this season, Jacob bro. Told me. I don't know how like how deep they're gonna get into, but it's it's gonna get really rough for Mark Grayson. But because it's adult, it's like an adult Justice League, basically. It's I'm really gonna wild. whoop that ass, like whoop that ass. Shit was crazy. Yeah. Omni Man is a generational menace. Yep. Nah, man. The him. I'm I'm hyped for season two though. No, that's about to be crazy. Yeah. Season two about to be crazy. You see, but here's the thing. If you don't beat your kids when they're small. You again with the domestic violence. Where did this come from? It's not domestic violence. It's child abuse. Again with the child abuse. Let me finish my point. You're going to have to beat your kids eventually. Do you want to do it when they're mad young and they can get over it? Or as a teenager and now look look at Mark. All fucked up in the head. I'm not going to lie though. It got so... Yeah, when he's a teenager and he figured his powers, his mom was like, go to your room. He was like, make me... I'm like, bro, this is your mom, bro. I like, was on that timing too, bro. It was like, uh, the the wife said some shit. He was like, "Are you questioning me?" I was like, "Oh, damn, Chris." Yeah, Brown, but like, Mark, I'm like, I'm like, does that really make you feel power that you some of you yeah. can't? Feel? I'm like, bro, like you you look at a bitch, bro. Like, come on, yeah, bro. yeah. Like, but it's your mom, but son. He got that from his dad, obviously. You, see, you heard how he was talking. He was like, he was like, "I love your mom, like like, like a, a pet." pet. Like yo, that's when I was like, "Oh no, nah, this nigga out of bed, tweaking." And bro, if my pops talking about I love your mom as a pet. We 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 shaking right there. I don't know if you. I don't know I mean, if you. Hands. I, I don't think we. Sh- I don't know if I would shake. But I'm like, nigga, what? I'm definitely. Shaking. I'm definitely gonna look at you a lot differently. It's bro. issues. It is issues. Yo. Call my mom a pet. Yeah, but like, listen. I, I'm swinging with everything I have. Everything in my. I'm not. Soul. I'm not swinging off the rip. I'm like, all right. I'm gonna take that and just like look at you a lot differently. If it get, if it escalates even more than that, then we got a problem. Though. What's the it, next? I did escalate. I'd be whoop that nigga's ass. It escalated pretty quickly. I'm talking in about fact, if we're in that situation, not Omni okay, Man. Okay, fine. Am I in the situation? Omni Man's yeah. That's Omni Man, bro. Like, I was thinking from like Mark and Omni Man's position. If I'm in that position, like, what's the escalation? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. If I'm Mark, yeah, I'm fighting you. Yeah, I'm fighting you, but. but you give it my actual dad. I'm like, all right, now we gotta like sit down, nah, that'd be like, so and have nuts. and have a conversation of like what is happening right now. That'd be nuts. Yeah, I'm hyped for it though. Nah, for sure. <laughs> Damn, y'all both 23. All right, you're all right, old ass nigga. That just hit me. We're all grown, bro. You're 24, yeah. bro. He's your Kobe year, bro. What are you doing for your it Kobe is, year? It bro? is your Kobe year. Not gonna lie though, for my Kobe year though, I'm trying to when I turn 24, I'm trying to be in LA. I'm in like, California. Yo. Like the late September, and also, yeah. also, um, Kalani Rogers, follow me because your cameraman follows me. Please follow me back. I'm trying to be constant with you. Please, 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 please. please. This nigga mad thirsty. Yeah, bro, thirsty Kalani Rogers. Rod- first of all, I got Kalani- some drinks in the fridge, bro. Bro, Kalani Rogers is actually funny though, bro. Like one of the three, she's four. Funny. Is- she's actually like she's different. Like she's different than those other <laughs> girls. <laughs> she's different. Shut <laughs> the fuck up. You know dude. damn well she actually is funny. Though. She is though. She is. I yeah, like. She's funny, bro. Like you dick writing for real. Nah, I'm dad is trying to make content when I go out there. Like, no, nah, that's, that's, that's the only goal. I'm supposedly she's dating Mark Phillips. That's no, the, she's not. That's the rumor. I don't right. know. No, if that she's is. not. Wait, so are we going to DreamCon? When is it? July June? something. July? But tickets drop this Friday. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Oh fuck. Why am I peeling this shit? Let me stop. It's fine. Uh, I'm gonna finish it then. Y'all wanna go? <laughs> oh no, I'm down to go. I'm it's down in to go. Austin, but it's in July. It's in July. If we can buy the tickets later, yeah, I'm down. But I'm pretty sure it's gonna sell out pretty fast. Yeah, it definitely will. It's this Friday is also kind of hard. I'm like, damn, I don't know when I get paid, but I want. I definitely want to go. I definitely will have the bread by then. We'll figure it out. But I definitely want to go to Dream Fund. I'm definitely going to California, Marvel Fit. That's one thing that's, that's going to happen. Like, we out, bro. I'm down. Yeah, I'm trying to go to California. B and B, B and B. I do want to. I do want to make concert with Kalani. I also just want to smoke a lot of weed because it's California. The weed out there is so nice. Bro. I know. I feel like. So nice. Like I feel like people gas it, but I'm like, I feel like you wouldn't gas it if Bro, it's not that OD. Yeah. So the shit I got right, it was nothing crazy. Like niggas gas it. It was just like smooth. It's just different than the shit out here. Like it's not as rough to pull. Yeah, and just the feeling was a little different, bro. Like it was just mad. Like I mean, that's also, that's also the vibe, bro. Cause it's like nicer yeah. out there and shit. Yeah, so nice. like, I feel like it's like the weather, bro. The weather's immaculate. Most so likely. nice. It's just different out there, bro. The vibes are just different out there. Yeah, no. I'm definitely want to go back. So yeah, I'm no, down. I'm trying. Yeah, I'm, uh, my birthday. I'm trying to be 20, us, bro. 24 in LA, bro. I'm trying to be 24 in LA. For a fact. Kobe year, bro. I don't know what I'm going to do for my Kobe. Kobe year. Go to LA again. We'll go twice this year. <laughs> Fuck it. Fuck it.
No, nah, I, I can't. I can't. Cuba. I can't do it twice. Huh? Cuba. Cuba. Why Cuba? If you go anywhere, in, if you go anywhere internationally, I'm not gonna lie. I'm trying to hit Mexico or DR. If you go anywhere internationally, it's like you a Haitian trying to go to DR, bro. Messi. Apparently, apparently, to a lot of people, I look Dominican. So we got Messi. Right. Que okay, Messi. I could, apparently, I look, apparently, I look Dominican, so I could pull it off. But bro, DR, like, think about it. I'm down to go. DR, DR is crazy. Bro. Like, you could. I've been to Mexico. I wouldn't mind. Stop going talking again, about the prostitutes DR. in DR. Get I wasn't even thinking about that. You, you seen those fucking TikToks of like niggas just like, just saying hi, and the girls just following them like crazy. Oh, from DR. Yeah, because things they if you're a tourist they know you got bread. Plus, I think if you spend like a, like no cap one hundred dollars they'll like they'll be with you for the day. Yeah, like, there's some girls like that, which is insane. Will she listen to my thoughts? Yes, bro. Yeah. She paid a hundred dollars. She in DR that's bread. So you got you got it for the day, bro. Will she tell me I'm funny for the full day? That's yes. all I need. I'm, yeah, probably. So she, she probably would, bro. You're so funny. Give wow. me another dollar. <laughs> and people, <laughs> that's wild. <laughs> nah, they'd be like. Shamir's looking sad Like am I funny She's just like <sighs> Puts the dollar Of course in. you are You're so funny Of course you are bro You know what's crazy Like people Niggas think that's crazy Like oh, $100 You beat me for the day In America It's kind of like 100,000 followers It should be with you For the day type shit Bro Cause like I didn't tell y'all Boy I, oh yeah, I told y'all That guy In the fucking hotel room The nigga that went The nigga that Met a girl She had 50k And he had only 500 followers though Find her followers, like do the video of the girl. She was down, and literally a minute later, nigga with hundred k pulls up. They do TikToks in the bathroom. They course some content. Tragic. She leaves the nigga in the hotel room to go get dinner with the guy who has hundred k. I saw them. I saw them later at the session. At like a session, that's and that's tragic, the only reason why he was there because I, me and my other guy, we were there. I picked him up. I'm like, that's tragic right there. Crazy. I'm like, wow. No, Klaus a drug, bro. Klaus really a drug. Like ten k don't mean shit. Take it on me. Yeah, it, 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 it you don't. It, you're not gonna get any attention until you hit like 50, 60 k. To be honest, facts. It's fucking crazy. That's a fact. Well, that's this episode. Thank y'all for coming on, man. Yeah, was good, man. This was a good episode. This was a good um, practice for the Juice Box Pod. Whenever that happens, yeah. it's gonna happen at some point, bro. For sure, and we for will sure. get you canceled on it. And we're gonna get a lot of OnlyFans models. Oh they, yeah, that's all we're gonna do. They're gonna spread their ass cheek right in there. Yeah, we're going to be like Fresh and Fit without the misogyny. Just the women. Fresh and Fit is the worst podcast I've ever trash. listened to in my life. I, like, they don't even sound... Anyone that says high-value men is a red flag. <laughs> <That's> a <laughs> like, flag. anyone says, yeah, these girls wait, love high-value men. What is a high-value man? Wait, Talk wait, to me. Wait, wait, let's dissect this concept. No, no, no. Like, what is... Thank you. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Whether it's Spotify, Apple, YouTube, all that. Thank you. Uh, make sure you like, share, subscribe, uh, share this with your mama, your dad, your side piece, your pet. That. Uh, yeah, your pet. That's awfully messy. The side piece, all of them. Um, follow the pod and IG, the Supervillain Show underscore. Uh, you guys want to plug your IGs and shit? Uh, no. Okay, I- I'll plug this shit. Follow him at Sham, Sham Wow underscore Wow. Yeah, and then yeah. Why not do that for you? Like, why not do that for you? Fuck you, I don't You're care. my son for real. That's why. That's nah, nah, nah. crazy. And also follow me at RD Aviate on all my social. Yeah, RD Aviate on my TikTok, IG, YouTube. And you see RD Aviate on my YouTube too. So yeah, yeah all cool of shit. that will be in the bio wherever you're yeah. viewing this. And also, you're not following him. What are you doing? Tying up. Follow under, him too. Underscore Fast. injustice. That's my G. And bro, subscribe to Juicebox TV, bro. Road to 2K. It's uh, crazy how we still not at 2K. No, it's no. crazy. What's going to happen is like the gloves are in the car. I'm going to start driving to people's houses. Oh, God. And they'll be like, you subscribe yet? No. All yeah, right. Then you get knocked out. Subscribe Knocking to your Juicebox TV, bro. No kizzy. Sub. Hey. But yeah. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. We'll see y'all next time. Peace. Love y'all.